Now in this part of the question, this is really just an extension of part A. We've got the two simultaneous equations that we found in the first part. We solved them for D and all we've got to do now to get A is literally substitute D equals minus 60 into either equation 1 or equation 2. So what I'm going to say is sub D equals minus 60 into equation 1. And if we do that then we've got A plus 9 times minus 60 for D equals 2400. And then if I work this out we've got A 9 times minus 60 is minus 540 and that equals 2400. Add 540 to both sides and what you have is A equals 2940. 2940 then for A. Okay, that brings us now to the end of part B.